So in this problem, we have 7 plus 13 plus 19 again, and it's going all the way up to 223, but I don't know how many terms there actually are. I need to add these all up, but um, I don't know what n is. I know that a is 7. I know that L, the last term, is 223. So I'm going to be able to use that formula, but only if I know what n is. So I need to work that out. And in order to do that, I must use this formula here, OK? The nth term formula. Because I can, I can identify the value of n using the last term. Because the last term, 223, is equal to the first term plus a certain number, so n minus 1, times d. So a is 7 plus n minus 1 times d, which is 6. So I need to rearrange this formula to get n equals, and that will tell me how many terms there are. So I can take 7 from both sides. 2, 2, 3, take away 7 is 2, 1, 6. Then divide both sides by the 6, and I get 36 is equal to n minus 1. So n must be 37. So there must be 37 terms in this series. So now that I have n, I can say that the sum of the first 37 terms, using this formula, is 1 half times n times a, so 7, plus the last term, 223. So 1 half times 37 times 7 plus 223, and that gets me 4,255. OK? And that's how I can find uh, how many terms there are in the sequence, the series, in order to then use the formula.